Hey guys, today I am back with a makeup tutorial, a summer goddess makeup tutorial. Vibe where everyone's like, oh my god, girl, you are glowing. When people tell me you are glowing, I'm like, okay, I did something right with my makeup. Can you think of a summer goddess? What does that exactly mean? Bronzy, glowy, sun-kissed skin. Very natural, not cakey at all. As if you were like in Ibiza on vacation all summer long and you just have this effortless sun glow seeping through your skin. We're gonna be transforming ourselves into a summer goddess clip up my hair and skincare what is underneath your makeup is going to seep through into that overall glowy look i'm going to start out with these centella toner leaves i don't know what sorcery is in these they just give me an insane glow so i kind of like put them on like this i let it like really melt into my skin automatic glow these are from the brand nunbazin by far my favorite toner pads it's insane instant glow instant wake up to your complexion it will look something like that after you did your toner pad and use your serum first i'm going to use this vitamin concentrated serum this is kind of like a vitamin c but it's an ampli format it's a lot less harsh on your skin than like a vitamin c would be just all over to kind of just give us that hydration glowy skin like look instant glow i'm gonna use this abaretta is a pore tightening serum a lot of those you can find on like yes style or style korean but this is just gonna tighten my pores and just give me the illusion of like literally perfect glass skin do you guys already see that i'm gonna use my mixoon centella essence this is going to give us like that silky baby kind of skin you want to use a water-based moisturizer this is really important most of the makeup we're going to use today is water-based so you don't want your makeup separating your melon glow from glow recipes a water-based moisturizer and i find that this just looks so good on your makeup it literally makes you look like you have glass skin and you guys will see do you see it? Our skin like literally looks like glass. I want to brighten my skin, so I'm going to be using this targeted eye depoofer. And this is going to give us that brightening effect. And like instantly, while I'm doing my makeup, I love to use a lip mask. Laneige is just, you can't go wrong with it. And then we're going to take this off at the end. Skincare is done. Just look at my skin. Now everything we're going to apply is just going to already have this glowiness coming from underneath. First product today, I have the Kosa's Dream Beam Sunlit. So this is a mineral SPF. It's a new product. It has peptides, ceramides, hyaluronic acid, SPF 40. So that's why I didn't apply an SPF. This is going to give us that goddess look underneath our makeup. We'll sponge like this. And we're going to begin to blend this into our skin. And you're gonna see the magic happen. Like, do you guys see? It's just giving us that glowy skin. This doesn't really provide coverage, it just gives like this kind of like goddess glow. It's like actually incredible. Also, one thing I forgot it's not a summer goddess look without a glow on your body. So, I'm gonna be using this Bali Body Illuminating Bronzing Serum. A little bit of this on my chest area. You also want to put a little on your shoulders. Now, we're ready for the foundation. The Fenty Beauty Soft Lit. This is the Naturally Luminous Longwear Foundation. I'm in the shade 290. And apply a light amount of this. It has like a semi-matte finish, but it's still luminous. So you're not going to look oily. My biggest pet peeve with summer makeup sometimes is that you can just look like a grease ball. This foundation defeats that because it's the mix of the luminosity while still giving you that matte finish. My eyes is like a perfect foundation, especially for the summer, because you look glowy, but you don't look greasy. And it's just like the perfect combo. I don't know if you guys can tell, but like it's literally just glowing. Do you guys see that? Yeah, this combo is insane, like actually insane. I'm going to underpaint and give us like the gorgeous goddess look. So I'm going to be using this new product from Makeup by Mario. This is in the shade Medium Dark. It's the Soft Sculpt Bronzing and Shaping Serum. It looks like this. This has like a little brush like this. You could use this multiple ways. You could apply this underneath your makeup. You can use this to give you like a soft bronzy look, which is what we're 
going to be doing. So I'm just applying it to my cheekbones. This is what's gonna give us like that gorgeous like goddess kind of feel. It's literally just gonna be like so soft and natural. It's also very buildable. You guys will see, I'm gonna start building it so that it's a little more prominent. I'm actually gonna use a brush like this to like really get it in there. And then we're gonna use our blender. Do you see that glow that it gives? It's so stunning. It's really like subtle, but the girls that get it, they get it. Like you see what I mean? Like some people might not even notice this, but I just find it to be so subtle and pretty. To set that in place, I'm gonna be using my All Hours Hyper Bronze from YSL Beauty. This product is gorgeous. I'll put some on my brush and we're gonna be setting that bronziness so that it does not move very lightly though. For concealer, you want a concealer that is not cakey. Say Beauty Slip Tint Concealer. She's that girl for the summer. And you wanna put a tiny, tiny amount. So I just put some on the hollows there and some right here on the edges. Tiny little sponge to blend in my concealer so it doesn't mix in with the bronzer. And you guys will see this is just gonna really brighten our eyes but still keep our under eyes really, really hydrated. I'm just doing the same thing here. This is such a stunning concealer. Like every single time I'm just like, wow. I'm not a huge fan of powders just because I have dry skin and I find that sometimes they can make my skin look patchy So I usually like to go in for a very sheer powder instead of like an actual like powder that you put on I find that it also sometimes like looks cakey and not natural So this is the Chanel Le Beige Healthy Glow Sheer Powder I know this is a bougier powder so if I do find a dupe or if you guys know a dupe for it Let me know so that I could share it with everyone But this powder you guys it's so sheer, it's so light, it never looks cakey. It always makes your skin look like skin. So I'm just gonna put some underneath my eyes to set the concealer anywhere that I'm a little like oily, which is usually my chin and just this area here on the top. I'm actually gonna put on a little bit of this by Mario on my lids. And this is gonna give like a nice bronzy finish to my eyes. And you guys will see, it's gonna come out so, so pretty like look at how stunning that is so i love that this is like a multi multi-use product you can use it for so many different things but i just feel like this gave me a gorgeous bronzy kind of finish to set the eyes i'm actually just going to use the same bronzer from ysl we're going to use that to set the eye area it's so stunning for the eyes i'm gonna take this ysl crush liner in the shade brown and we're gonna use this to like tight line the top of our the top of our water line or whatever and it's just gonna give like a deeper look to our eyes i don't know if you guys can see it but it just makes my lashes look more prominent almost naturally i do the same thing now on the other side pan so on like a tiny little thing here and to give the illusion of a like a slight wing that's all we're gonna be doing i want to contour a little tiny tiny bit of my nose so i just got this um two faced melting bronzing and sculpting stick and i'm just gonna apply the tiniest amount what i love is that this is like really subtle very natural it's not gonna look cakey it also smells like chocolate which is really nice and just Blend it into the skin. It's so subtle, like it almost just gives like a nice little pretty glow to the nose instead of like a sharp contour, which I find can look very unflattering sometimes. Set that with a little bit of powder, but very lightly because the powder is what could make it look a little unflattering. Invest in an eyelash curler, guys. This is the Shiseido eyelash curler and it is life-changing quite literally. You guys will see what I mean. It just makes me look like I'm wearing falsies. It's pretty insane. Like mascara, I want to use a really natural mascara, almost kind of giving that look like I'm not wearing mascara. This is the Lancome Definition Mascara. It's a very simple, everyday mascara. We're gonna just lightly, ever so lightly, coat our lashes to the point where it's like almost unnoticeable. And then what I feel like really gives me that natural look to my lashes is a lash tool like this that separates your lashes, giving it like a feather kind of look. Do you guys see that? So I'm gonna do the same thing on this side, giving me like a feathery look. And to blush, I'm so excited for this because I just got this blush in. This is the Giorgio Armani Luminous Silk Blush in the shade 62. Kind of like, a, I'm just gonna 
put it on the highest points of my cheekbone since I don't want to take away from my bronzer. I'm going to put a little bit in the middle of my nose. When I tell you guys, this is like the most blendable blush I've ever tried. Just watch. Like, do you guys see that? Like, I, I really don't know what sorcery is in this either, but it just blends. Like, it just, it doesn't stick to your skin. It just literally, like, blends. And it's very sheer, like, giving a very natural look. It's buildable, though. So if you want more, all power to you. I'll put a little bit of more as well so that it's very, like, blushy and summery. So I'm just gonna blend it into my skin. We want to be blushy and glowy and just radiant and blush like really brings in the radiance into our skin like <laughs> we were looking so glowy next another new product i have this is the kosas blushes life and it's a very glowy sheer powder this is new and i got the shade euphoria which i feel like is a really good match for this blush i'm just gonna go ahead and put it on my brush like this and <laughs> no this combo you guys i mean it's just gorgeous it really brings out the luminosity of the Giorgio armani blush i'm looking at my skin it does not look real like it looks like we have a filter on no it's stunning this with this is like the perfect liquid to powder combo put some faux freckles because i feel like it's not summer without faux freckles this is from the salty face i'm just gonna put it wherever i have freckles already which i have one here here and i have a lot on my nose so, and you can also by the way use a freck pen contour your nose if you go along bridging your nose which i've been doing lately and it's kind of cool blend 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 pat 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 because you don't want it to look unnatural like that's a pet peeve of mine when people don't really like blend in their freckles and it kind of it just looks like a dot for our lip i'm going to take off the lip mask that we've been wearing my toner pads that i used earlier we're gonna give our lips an undertone i want my lips to have already like a pinky under so undertone so that it really lasts throughout the day and i do this with my wonder skin lip stain in the shade xoxo i find that this shade is like the perfect light pink so you're gonna go over your lips and you leave it on for like literally 30 seconds leave this on for like 30 seconds let it dry. So now I'm gonna wipe this off. You guys are gonna see what I think is like the coolest thing ever. A natural lip tint. Look at that, you guys. This just on its own is already like so pretty and so natural. I'm gonna let that kind of like dry out. It's stunning. So what this does is that even when our lip gloss comes off, like we're still gonna have like this gorgeous pinky color underneath for my lip liner. I'm going to be using Charlotte Tilbury in the shade Super Size Me. I actually just got this lip liner in and I'm obsessed. It's like a rosy nude and it's perfect. If you're a brunette like me, it's the perfect color. Pillow Talk I find is a little too light for my skin tone sometimes. So this is like the perfect nude. Such a pretty lip liner. I am obsessed. Lips are drawn on for my lipstick. I'm going to be using a plum shade just to like circle this look together. Paracone MD, which I love their products. They're like all about like natural makeup. They just came out with this lip oil and this is in the shade Plum. It's so gorgeous. So you guys are going to see right now, like need I say more? I don't think I really need to say more, but this almost feels like a hydrating treatment on your lips in a lip oil, which it is. Paracone's like a skincare brand, so they really do hydrate your lips so this is my lip combo and i feel like it's just so feminine so girly so summery because it's like very pinky just anything pink screams summer to me to set everything in place i'm gonna do my glow recipe this is an ultra fine mist literally called watermelon glow so it's gonna give me that overall glow to the skin let that look marinate and this is the finished summer goddess makeup look let me thank you guys i feel like our skin is just glowing we look like we've been in ibiza all summer which is what i was trying to do i was like i want to look like i was in ibiza all summer long and i feel like it gave this look just is giving i have been on vacation i have a healthy glow your skin is glowing your chest is glowing guys this look makes me feel so feminine and so girly and just so healthy and radiating like our skin is literally just radiating from underneath and you guys need to try this makeup and if someone doesn't compliment you tell you that you're glowing they're lying i'm 
guaranteeing you guys if you guys do this routine someone's gonna tell you that you are glowing so this is the finished summer goddess makeup look i honestly really feel like so summery and so glowy so yeah you guys i am obsessed i will have everything i use down below linked on the my ltk shop all the exact products the exact sheets so yeah you guys hope you guys enjoyed this video i know we stepped away a little from the vlogs just wanted to do this look because i was just obsessing over all of these products and it's summer and i was like we we gotta do a summer makeup look because i i think they're just like all about being natural and glowy and that's just my vibe so yeah you guys if you guys are new make sure to subscribe to my channel i try to upload every single i usually do weekly vlogs but we do a little mix of both vlogs beauty everything like that make sure you guys leave a comment down below if you have any questions yeah you guys hope you guys try this look and try to recreate it um and if you do let me know how it comes out because i promise you like you are really gonna be glowing anyways i gotta go now but i will see you guys in my next video love you guys so so much bye